I smoke the whole damn pound. I'ma need another one, another one. Eyes closed, I won't come down. Only papers, no we don't fuck with blinds. Nigga, I don't just be sharing weed. A nigga got pounds to burn, that's apparent. Just cause you up in this bitch, don't mean you gon' hit his shit. You better roll some, coughing like you got a cold or something. I'm tryna OD on THC. Nigga, fuck around, gave young Khalifa pound, smoke a whole thing up in a week. Hey, hey, hey. Roll a joint, put a worm around that motherfucker, smoke it to the face. Oh shit, nigga just got some KK in and he say he on the way. Big Pete told me church get money on a merry single day. So I want everything, gave room, Mary playing they place, we mobbing. <laughs> nigga, we mobbing. Oh, we mobbing. Shit, shit, go, go. Nigga, we mobbing. Whoa. Now every place that we go, they say we can't smoke, but we do anyway. Cause real G smoke when they want. When they say turn down, we turn up, then turn up some more. When they say put it out, it's too loud, we burn up some more. Then we keep rolling and rolling and rolling and rolling. We keep rolling and rolling and rolling. As I promised the unboxing for these shoes that I got Saturday. Um, this is my first unboxing video. Uh, as you can probably tell, the box is kind of damaged. Um, obviously, I can't just be like, yo, can I get a cleaner box or like a nice looking box? Um, anyways, so there's some they're labeled on the box. Um, some Nike SJ3 trainer. Um, I probably won't use them to like really do much gym with anything gym related. But um, I told my dad that I needed some new shoes because I've been wearing. Like I showed you guys. I don't know if you, anybody's watched the video. I haven't really checked the views on it yet. But um, I showed you guys those Nike. Roche, my black solid ones that I normally use for work. I also use them for a little bit of the gym. I do have some other like older Nike, uh, like Lunar Light. I think that's what they're called, if I'm correct. Um, I was using those for gym shoes and I stopped because I got the Nike Roche and they're like way better for the gym. They're more comfortable. But anyway, so I was like, I've been wearing my work shoes and my gym shoes everywhere because my other, my Nike SB, because I guess, I don't know if I've ever talked about this, but I skate. And when I skate, I usually wear my Nike SB, but... Um, and normally I would get, like, some SBs to, like, casual shoes to walk around in, but I went to Paxson, couldn't find anything that I really was into. I looked at some Adidas there, and, like, they just, there was one that, like, fit good, but it just, like, I didn't know if I liked how they looked at me, so. By the way, this lighting is, like, really bothering me, but, you know, so let's see if I can turn that down a little bit so you can see me just a tad bit, because I don't also look so white. Anyways. So, I know a lot of vloggers that I watch do a lot of unboxing videos. I mean, normally they talk about their clothing. Um, so, anyways, I thought I'd share these shoes that I got. Like I said, they're from Nike. Uh, it's the Nike store that's in Michigan City. Gone there a couple times. I've only bought, like, one of the pair of shoes from there. It was, like, a long time ago. Also, actually, I had bought some soccer cleats there for soccer season when I was in high school. Anyways, though, so, let's open the box up. By the way, I did actually get these for or my Dad, my stepfather purchased them. The guy I live with, he purchased them for me because I had asked him, and I didn't have the money. But uh, there, here you go. So they're Kelvin Johnson trainers. They're actually like I looked up his other shoes that he's had. He had some other cool stuff that I looked up, but like I said, these are at the store, and I had been looking at other shoes, and. I was just like, fuck, I'm not buying anything, apparently. Or, he, my dad's not going to give me any shoes today because I can't find anything I like. But then I happened to, like, come across these, and I was like, yeah, maybe I'd wear them. Tried them on, I actually, like, they're super freaking comfortable. And I actually was like, hmm, I don't think I look half bad in these. 
So I end up getting these and like like I said, they're, I've already tried them on. I haven't worn them out in public yet, but I'm planning on wearing them tomorrow. Class, uh, I really like, I know the colors look super cool. I mean, I thought they were like, they had like a basketball, I thought they had like a basketball look like to the front of them at first, but I don't know, I put them on, like I said, they're a little more bulky and like, than I would choose that I would normally wear. I would normally wouldn't wear the style of shoe all the time, but it's like, I know, I've been getting really into like more just like sports shoes and Nike stuff related. And I've also been like looking at like a lot of the different Adidas stuff too. And I don't know, I didn't, like I said, I didn't buy anything Adidas that I liked because it was such like a, because normally like how they work or like how Adidas stores work or how like any shoe store would normally work is like if you go to an outlet, they're gonna have more of the stuff people like don't normally buy all the time, or that are like they're still popular, but they're just not like people don't purchase that type or that quality or the one style of shoe as much. I should say, I should say, wow, can't freaking talk. Um, so like they didn't really have anything like cool Adidas. I was looking for some like tubular shoes or like the tubular style, but like I said, I couldn't find anything that I just really. Didn't like my sister was looking for some of the uh, old style like or the original Adidas shell toe, and those were really coming back in style. Apparently, I didn't know about that until then. So like she couldn't get the ones that she wanted. But so anyways, and then I went to, like I said I went to Paxson, got a couple of clothes there. I could show you those too because actually I was pretty happy in what I actually got there. So, um, but like I said, yeah. I, I just couldn't find anything. They had like a per, they had like a buy one get one half off shoe sale at Paxson, and I tried like six pair of four, probably about six pair. Yeah, like I said, six pairs of shoes on there, and I just couldn't. F either they were like too small, they like just didn't fit right, or I just wasn't sure if I actually like liked them how they looked on me. So I didn't end up getting anything there, and I was like, okay, let's. We were going to leave, and then I'm like, oh, I really want to go to Nike. My dad's like, well, my mom's going to go do some her shopping real quick if she's actually going to get anything. Our mom wasn't planning on getting anything. So she went to her, and I went with my sister to Nike. End up, we looked around for, like, a good 10, 15 minutes. I was like, damn, I don't think I'm going to end up getting anything. I can't find anything I like. And then finally we went down one little last aisle, and these were at the end of it. And I'm like, actually, these are really cool. So, yeah, end up getting these, and I didn't know, like, I kept seeing the signature all over the place because it's like, it's in the inside the shoe right there, and then it's also on the tongue. It's kind of sorry if I can't really show you. It's hard to see it, but yeah. And then, like I said, it was inside the shoe, and I was looking. I was like, oh, I don't really know who signature this is. And it's uh, engineered to the exact specifications of Calvin Johnson. So I was like, oh, that's really freaking cool, actually. So, and my mom's normally like, I mean, I'm 21 years old, but my mom's not really like, it's like, oh, my, my sister and I shouldn't get white shoes. She's never, she's not a big fan of anything, like, super white. I ended up getting a white shirt, too, which is really cool. I'll have to show you guys that. But, like, yeah, these shoes, for the most part, are, like, pretty white besides a little, the, the gray that goes around, which is, like, a, it's, like, a shiny and, I don't know. It's kind of hard to explain. But, like I said, these are super comfortable, and I know the sole... Like, the bottom of the shoe is freaking cool, I guess, I would say. I mean, that's pretty cool. And I'm, like, I love really crazy design colorful shoes. It's, I've always been like that. I don't know. Like, anything super plain, I'm, like, not usually a big fan of. But, I mean, from time to time, I get them. Anyways, like I said, uh, as promised, I'm going to do an unboxing video. Like I said, none of people, like, do unboxing videos for, like, things that come in the mail or whatever. But I was like, come on. And another thing I thought was kind of crazy is my foot must have grown because these... That it was just because it was the style of shoe, but at a ten and a half, didn't expect that. I was going for like a ten because all my other, my, like I said, the Nike SB skate shoes that I have, that was the only reason I got new shoes because I grew out of those and I wore those all the time, and I ruined them really. For the most part, I like wore them out. So, anyways, that's why I had to get the new shoes. Um, I hopefully will do some more vlogging today. Um, I don't really know what I'm gonna do today. I got a two design projects to work on for my observational drawing class that I need to finish. For the most part, I'm probably just going to like hang around. I got class tomorrow. Uh, so, 
yeah. Anyways, so like I said, I just thought I had to share that, and I was pretty excited about doing this unboxing video, so. Yeah. Okay, so I did the unboxing video, and that'll be in this vlog. Anyways, so like I said, I did a little clothes shopping too. Just try and get this since you have to do a horizontal view in this video. Or else it looks really freaking odd. And nobody wants to see a video with a black wash, as I've been told. Anyways, so like I said, the reason I was really happy with the, the clothes that I got, I guess I would say, is because they all had that like the extension kind of thing to it or like the make it look like it's longer just i don't know it's that new like i guess it was a streetwear all the stuff i got was on sale so end up being a buy two get one free so it, I, my mom read it wrong so i almost got only two things anyways i don't know if like like i like the sweatshirt and i like the style of it I don't know if I like the whole, like, graphic to it. I mean, it's cool, but, I mean, I don't know. It's in the hoodie, too, which is kind of nice. This is just a plain gray hoodie. And the only reason I got the three that I got is because one of my hoodies I, like, kind of ruined recently. See, so it's just pretty much plain gray. Uh, there's, like, two grease spots, so my mom told me how to get those out so that the hoodie will be nice again. It's a hoodie that I always wear, like, usually pretty much in my vlogs all the time, besides that, like, purple one. Here's my second favorite. I thought this was kind of neat. I was between a darker gray and this gray. And I thought this was kind of nice. So I got this too. Um, I like it because it's like, once again, it's got that extension kind of thing to it. And I like it because it was like a cut off or the way it was cut like this, the fabric. Anyways, it's, it's nice. And like I said, on sale once again. So, uh, also this is, where I got this is the Sun in um, Michigan City. If you have or have not been to it, I not normally I don't always buy from Sun because I'm very loyal to Zoomies. I have a lot of Zoomies clothing, but like I like Sun style and like a lot of their stuff. They almost gave me a different shirt or whatever because obviously something happened with the little ink thing on the security thing. But it didn't bleed through, so I was like, you know what, it's fine. I'll take it because I like it, and it was the only one that was, like, left. And I grew, and I need a large. Okay, so what I'm about to show you is the f my favorite purchase that I made, for, or my dad made, I should say, for me. Um, This is my favorite one, and I like it because of the how long it is at the bottom. I think it's super cool. My dad thought it was so strange. He's like, that shirt is way too big for you. I'm like, no, it's the style, you goofball. I know a lot of people don't say goofball anymore, but I don't feel like just throwing our random curse words now. Anyways, but he thought it was, like, too long for me, so he wasn't about to buy it. I'm like, fine, you don't buy it, I'm gonna buy it, because it's freaking dope. And so, I mean, it just says Ben Trill, and, like, it's got stuff on the sides, and obviously I showed you the stuff on the bag just now. Um, it says, I think that says, same thing on this sleeve, it says, and it, as it does on the other one, if I'm correct. I can't get the freaking El Ben Trill high vibes. And it says the same thing on the sleeve, too. And it's kind of hard to see because all of it's in white and the shirt's like an off white. So, anyways, though, this is, like I said, the, my favorite uh, shirt that I had gotten. But So, I had to show that to you guys. Since I did the unboxing too. Um, once again, all at Paxson. They had a big sale going on, so I figured why not. And I also, like I said, I had like sweatshirts and I have like stuff that I like need to get rid of, but I haven't yet. There's probably like stuff I get there. I'm gonna try and sell in Michigan to this place called Playlist Closet where they buy your clothing. And whatever I don't, then I'll just end up like giving to like either friends or something. Cause I do that every now and then when I have clothes that. I don't either wear anymore or like they just don't really fit me that well that I like anymore so anyways just had to share that so also just thought I'd throw this out there I don't know how good this video looks on me right now so let's find that out before I just keep recording yeah so um also just want to give a 
thanks. I'm starting to get subscribers now, and there are more and more subscribers, so I'm pretty, like, happy about that. So I just thought I'd have to give a thanks out there. Also, don't forget, if you like this video, to give it a thumbs up, and then subscribe also if you enjoy it, because I'm going to start doing more and more. Hopefully, I'll start doing more, like, unboxing and, like, clothing review eventually. Takes a little while, because I got to get a job, or I have a job, <laughs> well, I have a job, but... Like I said, my hours have been cut back, and they're also not paying for overtime right now, so... I mean, not that I do overtime, but... Um... Let's see, what else? Uh... I forgot what I was going to say on that. I thought I was going to say something else. Anyways, like I said, though, I do appreciate the subscribes and the views on the videos now, so... Hopefully I'll start getting more and more, and then hopefully I'll start asking some questions or giving me, leaving me some comments, because I would like to do a uh, drum question sometime. Um, I would do that in Michigan, because my stepdad that I live with doesn't really like me drinking that often. I don't know, like, uh, like with his job, as stressful as it can be, he likes to drink, and so he doesn't like me drinking that all that often. But when I go home, I do drink, and I hang out with a lot of my friends, and so it would be cool to, like, do drunk questions. And also, I will start probably making videos, because I do watch a lot of tipsy bar bartenders. Shout out to him, because, got your Snapchat, your stuff that you do on there is pretty funny, and I like the stuff you make on there. I've tried a couple of your drinks. Their drinks are awesome. So shout out to you for that. Uh, so yeah, if you don't follow him or, like, or subscribe to his videos, like, you have to. I mean, if you're underage... I don't condone underage drinking, obviously, but, uh, like, if you're interested in, like, getting to, like, watch some of his videos to know what you are thinking about drinking on your 21st, or if you're coming to your 21st sometime soon, then yeah. But no, I've made a couple of his drinks, and his drinks are awesome, so maybe when I go home, I will, uh, because the next time I plan on going home, I do plan on making another one of his drinks, so I will blog that, uh, but yeah, so peace out for now. I'm going to go to the gym, obviously, later tonight, but I got some homework I got to do, so yeah, peace out for now. So, eating some, well, about to eat some lunch. Uh, cooking some honey barbecue bone swings. Not quite done yet. Um, going to work on my two drawings that I have to do. Uh, but first, I want to watch while I eat the uh, last night's episode from The Walking Dead since I didn't watch it. Um, just kind of figured I'd. I don't know, I felt a little weird, but I guess I feel weird by giving a play by play. But since it's Monday and I don't have class today and I just have to work on those things, um, really just kind of chilling. I mean, because I did the unboxing already, I uh, showed some of the clothes I got from Saturday. Um, also, I, since I've already kind of started editing for the video, or for the vlog for today, I did a different type of intro, it was about a minute and something long, so, uh, when I get the views on it, please comment and tell me what you thought of the intro. It'd be much appreciated, because if not, if you didn't like it, I'll try and come up with something else to do. Um, if you did, let me know, because I'll keep doing similar things like that. So, but yeah, so comment and let me know what you thought. So I uh, finished my homework and whatnot. Now I'm headed to the gym. Probably be there for about an hour, just a little longer. Uh, then uh, probably gonna get myself a Oreo McFlurry from McDonald's. Probably doesn't sound very good to have after lifting and working out, but uh, carbs is carbs, I guess, if you say so. <laughs> Gotta get that. The dairy in too, you know? <laughs> so yeah. Um, probably vlog a little bit more, 
after this, so deuces.